Yeah, we'll do the call deathless speedrun attempt at least for the sneaky snap, sneaky sabotage. It's important to remember there's gonna be three different types of missions, right? So this is just one of them. This is just one of them. So in the next two weeks, we'll get the other two, uh, like, call missions. And then we'll see how that goes. Then we will see how that goes. This where Narmer make veils. Okay, so I'm just gonna speedrun it. If you don't know how to do the mission, it is pretty simple after all, right? You just go around looking for loot. The K-Drive parts shine blue. The chipper box doesn't have any sort of indicator, so you just gotta visually find it. Still say blow up better. And yeah, luckily the like dog tags at least warn you. Like they have See that big door up ahead? They have a notification for where they may be, so at least that's nice. I'm impressed. Okay. Hopefully we'll be able to find some stuff. Point and click. Everything is randomized for all the spawns, chipper box, other stuff. Yep. All random. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I just go down here, like start in a square, do one by one. You can melee these guys, and you can use the third ability to, s like, hit the deacons so that they get stunned. There we go. But you just got to hit all of these things. Then you gotta go back here. We've disabled one out of four locks. That's it. one lock there. That's disabled. And then we are good to go there. There's like a couple other things. There's a lot of side stuff you can do in this mission. But honestly, oh, it just doesn't even matter. See, like, you can s stun deacons with your third ability. You can't kill them until you get the, like, aerial nuke, but you can stun them that way. Okay, so, oh, that's Chipper's toolbox. It can spawn there, apparently, too. Yeah, it can spawn a lot of areas. See? The K-Drive uh, parts shine blue, and they can be literally anywhere. Literally anywhere. I just came across one randomly. Like, what is this? What is this? I think the spawns are just too anarchist. <laughs> it's just so annoying. They're just all over the place. Legitimately everywhere. I'm drinking water right now. I'm all out of coffee. Oh, I was gonna warm up my coffee. I forgot to actually warm it up though. No! So you can just get by him. Right? Just beat them up with your third ability. Any blue in there? Any blue in there? No, no. Okay, let me just run away. Let me just go teehee. Run. Oh, I missed that. My bad. Okay, let me just quickly kill him. Clean kill. Quickly kill you. Oh. Nearly rage quit and you saw a deacon. The deacons are easy, luckily. Oh no, I need to pop this thing up. I didn't do that yet, did I? Let's go here. Is that a deacon all the way over there? Wrecked. Absolutely wrecked. Yeah, I have to do this first. Come on. Then you can spawn the deacon. I'm sorry, stun the deacon. That was a little scary. Did not enjoy that one. Just one I think more. I'm supposed to go all the way on this side now to hit that one. You're done. Time to go through, Carl. Sneak, sneak, sneak. <laughs> Smart. So you can do that, right? Stun him what I'd recommend. Always stun them with that third ability. So deacons can just like stun you and shove the thing on your face. And if they do that, then you die. So try not to let that happen at all. Try not to let that happen. But if, if you do, whew, might be a huge pain in the butt. So a bunch of K-Drive parts can spawn over here. Inside. 
in case you weren't aware. To be able to just speed run around here. Chipper toolbox, much like everything in this, can spawn in honestly like 30 different locations. There's so many different spawn locations for everything that it actually sucks. Yeah, could two K drive parts. Woo. Do that and I'll have a split second during reboot to inject my sabotage instructions. Okay. Hurry. That one is that. Call not understand. Look around. Do you see anything that could tell you the key sequence? That one's that. That's it. Cool. Oh. Yeah, you just gotta mash up with the ones on the walls. Now to make some noise. They have to think this is a raid. So what we're trying to do is deathless and under 15 just cuz. And I just want to show you how easy it is if you just YOLO it and run. I think I saw K drive on the camera. Yeah, probably. Deacons are hunting you. Tinkering just got me access. Like, there's a lot of I have two of the K drive parts, right? And they're just like a huge pain to find. It'll melt anything, including right, like they could be anywhere. There's like one that spawns maybe down there. So it's honestly such a huge pain. Such a huge pain in the butt. But hey, it is what it is. It is what it is. So how you kill the deacons once you get this? Just hit G, boop, click them, nuke. Oh! Okay, well now I have to find the final K drive part. My God, I found the K drive board there. Hmm. And now I'm just missing one more thing. I don't know what it could be. But now I'll show you guys how you can like whole hog this. I'm like, yeah, I don't know where the final part could be, right? No, that's... Get him! Okay, hit the deacon with that. Blue girl shoot good. Right there. Is that it? Oh my, and I even found the K-Drive by pure luck. The K-Drive is the worst thing that Satan has ever created for us to find for this mission. Um, if you ever see this, DE people, it's Satan's K-Drive. Same with the toolbox. I'm. Can you imagine the one run I'm not even trying to find the K-Drive and I easily find it? What is Warframe? How is it always that's how that works, right? The one mission where I'm like, okay, well, I'm just gonna not worry about it. Push through pain. I'm trying not to die, so I need to make it up here. So that I can get health again. Arachnoid's a huge pain. Yeah, we found them all. Nice. Yeah, mods will take a couple weeks to actually be able to... for us to grab them, right? I'm gonna get them all to run up here. Oh yeah, and little uh, tag guys can also be right there. So now none of the enemies will spawn here. They're all locked out, right? Nice! Okay, good Rachnid speed run to get the K drive. Remember to use the like tactical air nuke on the little guy. Once his health bar comes back up, that's when I click this, right? Like you'll see. Now I can hit him with it. And it has the barrel right there, so I can freeze him even more. This is how you just make the Rachnoid 
die instantly. <laughs> Boom! That's how you do it, boy! See? Not that, not that bad, right? Not that bad! And that is how you complete Call's Garrison mission in, like, sub-10. But, like, the main thing was, uh, without dying. So you can hit the Deacons with your third ability, you can do the AoE nuke, and you can just straight up shoot. Oh, not too bad, we did it all on the final one by complete accident. I gave up on finding the confiscated K-Drive parts, but I mean, like, hey, there we go. And, uh, yeah, as always, thank you. Like, sub. Cheers.